Thank you for purchasing a Walk on Wheels pet wheelchair. This instructional video will provide you with everything you need to know to set up the wheelchair and get your pet walking. Here's what we'll cover in this video. What's in the box? How to set up the wheelchair? Putting your pet in the walk and wheels. Making sure the wheelchair is fitted properly. Helping your pet get used to the wheelchair. Optional wheelchair accessories available for purchase. How to contact us. And finally, you can watch pets taking their first steps and enjoying their new life in their walk and wheels. Your walk and wheels box comes with everything you need to set up the wheelchair. Inside the box, you'll find a manual, a toolkit including an Allen key and set screws, a wheelchair frame with the shorter snap in length and width extenders already installed, an extra width connector, the belly belt, two stirrups, two wheels with struts, two extra snap in length extenders that are longer, the front harness, and the rear leg rings. Let's begin. The wheelchair has a sticker on the back end that shows which side is right side up. Keep this facing up. Turn the dial cap counterclockwise to release the leg of the wheelchair. Move the leg so it is perpendicular to the wheelchair frame. On the circular black knuckle, you should see the single raised indicator centered between the opposite two. Then repeat this process on the other side. Next, we'll put on the all-terrain wheels. The struts are attached to the wheels so you can snap them right in using the push buttons. Adjustments for the height, length, and width can be modified and fine-tuned after your pet is in the wheelchair by using the push buttons. Next, attach the leg rings. The leg rings are the support system for the rear part of your pet. The leg ring tubing gets connected onto the wheelchair so that it forms two C's. The clips for the leg rings go over the frame. The top part of the clip that the leg ring connects to has a little hole on it. This is the locking mechanism. It goes over the silver shoulder socket screws. Push upward until it snaps into place. Once you hear the snap, you know it's locked in properly. To unlock the leg rings, put your thumb in the round circle and pull downward. The leg ring should look like a cradle or baby swing that hangs two to three inches below the wheelchair frame when you push down on them. If it hangs down further, you can adjust the leg rings by removing them from the wheelchair.
The excess Velcro on the sides cross over the back of your pet to keep your pet secure. You don't have to use these. Or Velcro the two sides together to form handles. Your pet's toe pad should just touch the ground. You will need to use the stirrups if your pet's legs are paralyzed. The stirrups are attached to the back of the wheelchair frame on the two silver metal loops. Make the stirrups snug by using the push lock buttons so that the legs stay at a comfortable height, suspended with the rubber tubes right above the hock. You can adjust the length of the stirrups here, or you can flip the stirrups up over the frame to shorten them like this. Adjust them to be about four or five inches from the ground. Some pets will need additional support under the belly. This is helpful if your pet's spine bows downward for overweight pets or for pets with spinal or disc issues. There are two sides to the optional belly belt, a side with a loop and a clip and a side with Velcro. Put on the side with the loop and the clip by sliding the loop through the extender. You can keep it in place by putting the rope around the clip of the extender so it doesn't slide further back and then tightening it. Next, undo the Velcro on the other side of the belly belt. Put the Velcro side over the extender and reattach the Velcro. Put the rope around the side clip again and tighten. Make sure that the red part will face the underside of your pet. Before putting your pet into the wheelchair, you need to put the front harness on your pet. When you hold the harness up, the blue strap should be at the top. Your pet's head will go through the black and blue straps. Put the harness on and pass the red strap under your pet behind the front legs and click it on the side neoprene panel. To put your pet into the wheelchair, gently take your pet's two back legs and put them through the leg rings. Pull up the extenders, putting each one through the D-ring on the front harness and clipping it into place on the extender mount pads.
To get your pet out of the wheelchair, first take your pet's legs out of the stirrups if you're using them. This is very important to remember. Then undo the clips on the front harness and gently lower the wheelchair frame to the ground. Lift your pet's rear legs out of the leg rings. The wheelchair is made to be flexible and move with the body of your pet, but if you prefer to reduce the flexibility and the rattling sound, you can tighten up the frame by using the enclosed set screws. There are three locations for screwing in the set screws. Outside the back of the frame, outside the end of the frame, and the bottom of the interior side leg. Do not over tighten the screws. Here are some tips to keep in mind to help your pet get used to the wheelchair. Let your pet get used to wearing the harness first, then introduce your pet to the wheelchair. Always use positive reinforcement for encouragement. If your pet is food motivated, be sure to have very special treats on hand to reward your pet's first steps. Start with short supervised sessions in the wheelchair. Five or 10 minutes up to several times each day until your pet is completely comfortable in their walking wheels. Here are some Walk and Wheels accessories for the wheelchair that may be purchased separately if you wish. Slide the amputee cover over your pet's leg ring to create a comfortable seat for your rear amputee pet. Combine our walk in dog boots with clip-on stirrups to lift your dog's legs off the ground when using their cart. Ideal for paralyzed pets and those with limited use of their back legs. The Walk and Lift Rear Harness is an easy way to support your pet's back legs in and out of their new wheelchair. The Walk and Warrior Harness is designed for maximum comfort, safety, and adjustability. With both front and rear harnesses available, the Warrior Harness allows you to safely support your pet and comes in pink, blue, and green camo. Please refer to your Walk and Wheels manual to review these instructions and remember that customer service representatives are just a phone call or website live chat away, or you can email. Thank you.